I wanted to take a couple minutes to show some of the details of our car wash. Uh, we choose these nozzles here. They're, uh, if you can see that, it's one eighth inch uh, nozzle hole. As you can see through there. Also, the thread is smaller. And I use a wand that is smaller than enough to fit this. You gotta make sure it fits your, your wand and your gun. So as you notice the, the numbers on here, the numbers show the size of the nozzle hole, as you can see, a hole there in the center. And then you have the 1506. Well, those are two separate numbers really. Uh, the 15 represents the pattern of the spray, 15 degrees. So 15 degrees would be similar to this. So that would be coming out of the nozzle from here, coming out this way. So 15 degrees gives you a pretty narrow spray pattern. And comparative to a larger nozzle here I have of a one that we use in our automatics, it's a 2507, but we'll get to that just in a second. Here, so let's go back to this 1506. 06 represents the gallons per minute at a certain pressure, or PSI. So, for instance, I have this chart here downloaded off the internet. If you go over to the 06 or the 6, you follow it over to the we use, usually runs our pressure our pumps at 1200 psi our pumps run at 1200 psi and if you follow over from the six to the 1200 you get 329 3.29 gallons per minute okay and then comparing a this uh, 07 if you go down, follow it down, you get this next number here. 3.83 gallons per minute. So the bigger the nozzle hole, the more water it's gonna spray out at the same PSI. So that makes sense, doesn't it? Here's another factor to look at. We have, uh, we had that one was a 15 degree. So in this one, as you notice, so it's 2506. So everything's the same except for the first two numbers. So 25 represents the 25 degrees. So here you have the two different numbers off this chart. If you look at the 1200 PSI compared to the number of the only nozzle itself, 0.6. 6.0 nozzle size just comparing the the uh, degree of angle on these two nozzles makes a difference in how they wash for instance a wider spray or like the 25 degree angle compared to the 15 degree angle the wider one will be the 25 so the 25 degree angle will cover more area at one time but the intensity will not be as great on the surface unless you get really close with a nozzle. So for the customer to have the intensity needed, you want to go with a narrow one. That's what we, I've chosen to do here at this wash. So if you have any other questions or like to see a video about anything, let me know. Please like and subscribe. Have a good day.